now I'm not in Podunk, USA anymore. I'm over in Baltimore visiting friends and family. This is Federal Hill. Uh, this is a place where the uh, Union Army camped and built this fort. But surrounding it is Baltimore. Usually when people say Baltimore, they think, oh no, bad area. I'm thoroughly enjoying myself. This is a beautiful place. Uh, yeah, there are places you could go in there that I probably won't go in there and I shouldn't go in there. But overall, for a country bumpkin like me, this is awesome to come see. We're seeing a lot of cool architecture and that's what me and my wife like to do. Uh, it's a beautiful place. There's a lot of people here. For where I live, it's gonna be very easy to survive a worst case event. Here, it's another matter. You have masses of people. You don't have any infrastructure as in as any way to, you know, get food. There are some industry here. There's a sugar factory close by, Domino's, Domino's Sugar right over there, somewhere over there, right there. They got a huge port here, there's a lot of in industry over in that side. This place is huge. I have no idea how these people would survive an economic collapse or depression or a crisis where things go crazy. So if you live in an area like this, do your best, but also have a bug out plan. Have a plan where you could go somewhere safe. So if you're trying to get in touch with me, I've gotten a lot of phone calls. I have not returned some of them just because of time. Uh, I am gonna make a boots on the ground this evening just to keep up with it so I don't get so far behind because if you take the time to send me an email, I wanna share your information the best I can but thoroughly enjoying myself. I have not had gone on a vacation in years and years and years, and this is sort of a vacation, but slash, I am doing a lot of work. But look at the apartments over there. I don't know if you can see all those apartments. There's, there's tons of people here, I don't know, millions. I have no idea how they're gonna survive a worst case event. Also, Baltimore would be a target in a war it has a lot of industry, a lot of port facilities. They're just massive. So just keep prepping, keep preparing. And let me go catch up with my wife. I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching.